What's up you guys, After Show Reacts here and today I'm going to be reacting to some more Supergirl. This is season 2 episode 4 and it's titled Survivors. I was going to react to this last night but full disclosure, uh, the new season of Fortnite came out and I got a little distracted. Um, but these are all out on the correct day so nothing's late so whatever. Um, yeah. Side note though. Um, this has got nothing to do with Supergirl, but I just want to tell you guys, um, my, my dog is like really old, um, she's a dingo, and, um, she's like molting all the time, um, and I just put these, these pants on, these leggings, and I just walked out for like two seconds, and she's always underfoot these days, she just doesn't, she moves really slowly. She's a really old dog now, I swear. And, uh, I only just slightly grazed her. And I come in here to sit down to start reacting. And there's, like, this giant, just, amount of dog hair just all over my legs. And I'm like, I literally just slightly touched you. And I have all of this dog hair all over me. How? How? How is that possible? Like, You know what the worst part is? The worst part is uh, one day in my life it's like my goal to have a Siberian Husky and like they're worse with the whole molting so that's gonna be fun um but anyways <laughs> completely nothing to do with Supergirl um but whatevs uh we're here uh I hope you guys have enjoyed the first three episodes um I have, so let's get into the next one. Oh, Prince, you can't stay here. Okay. This is Kai Baka. Tony, Jim. The emissaries, Ted. And so Sorry, is the plan. Sorry, I've altered my mic. Uh, oh, so this is Krypton's door. Might we be need not to get out of here. Really I can't fly one of these. Can you program a destination? Yes. Over no. the top, getting in You need to save yourself. For once in your life, obey me. Those are my people out there. Why? Let me share in their fate. You were a palace guard? For the great royal family of Daxon. Ugh, they were the worst. And their son, the prince, he was rumored to be the worst of the worst. Frat boy of the universe. Uh, he, he had his good moments, too. So now you remember what happened? Daxon? Because you... I can't be the only one left, right? Like I'm sorry, but no. Hey, do they play Garada here? What's Garada? It's like soccer with dragons. No, not that. You have uh, dragons? We have PlayStation. Great. So when do we get out of here and do that... that thing you just said? Actually... <laughs> figured it wasn't a Halloween costume. Right, I forgot you two were running buddies. Do you know what species it was? He's civilian. Little He's got months that. of scar tissue built up, heavy bruising on the knuckles. He didn't just go down fighting, he made a habit of it. Doesn't make any sense. Civilia is a utopia. Well, looks like our killer was alien too. Our super lab run some tests on that? That's exactly what I was thinking. Well, seems like you two have got it handled. Well, maybe you can uh, go over this with the contacts in the streets? I already made a few calls, but I'll follow up though. Barsha Um Okanda. Good morning to you. Didn't take you for a noon drinker. Just water, please. The White Martians attack. Where, where were you? I was taken to the internment camp near the Gala Crater. That was the worst of them. Just to be clear, enough space to tunnels. anyone who, who's curious, sometimes the cars would just I've kill seen someone young at random, set off a panic. So. And then watch as I know. green bodies trampled over each other. I thought we might take the bond you want to share minds yes would you honor me with that i have customers i Can would talk about this some other time say no to that hey talk to you a minute i don't know you now you do mcpd we're investigating a possible homicide I am not 
the last green Martian. There is another. Her name is Magan. I offered to merge with her in the Martian way. <laughs> but you guys just met. It's psychically, Kari. The bond is the traditional Martian way of communicating. We, we link minds, share dreams, emotions. That's very intimate. Memories. I am grateful to have you both in my life. I truly am. But with Martians, it's it's different. It's deeper. deeper Kara could talking, understand that. Fuller. Remember to always believe in yourself, my daughter. Yep. Thanks for the advice. Oh, hey, what is this place? It's it's private. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't. Shouldn't you be testing your abilities with Wynn somewhere? Yeah, Wynn said we sh we could chillax for five. Whatever that means. <laughs> Daxon, sister world to Krypton, a race of bullies and hedonists committed only to their Bye, own Mom. They are selfish. Sorry about that. <laughs> no, it was uh, an apt description. Well, Hank said I had to stay in the DEO for my protection. What if you were to accompany me outside? Surely I'd be safe from humans with the most powerful woman in the world, right? <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. Because you're from Krypton and I'm from Daxon. No, I just... I'll see you later. <laughs> they came from beyond the stars, across the vastness of space, light years, parsecs, infinite distance. And why did they come to invade? Hey! My first instinct is to call her giant, so she's giant. Neither. Tonight, it's triple stakes, everybody, because we've got the killer, Bravik himself. Quill! Miss Martian! Fight! That's roulette. Somebody's gonna get killed. <sighs> Black Canary should be trying this. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have an unexpected and new main event for you tonight. Something very special. The Girl of Steel and meet your opponent. Yeah, she's definitely Draga. Like, she's not as adorable as that. Wow. Sierra on Goldos. But she's got like a bit of a snap to wear like giant. Your streak's about to continue. No kids. <laughs> Are you all right? I hope too many people didn't bet on me. I don't think there's enough time to Are you sure you're okay? Bed I just got my ass handed to me by a seven foot alien gladiator. I am nowhere near okay. She was participating. Maybe she was kidnapped. They call her. Miss Martian. Hank. Maybe not. Uh, what are you going to do? No heat vision, no x ray she's vision. She's Miss Martian because she's been 15. But you're twice. strong. Strong as Kara? Like, no, not even close. So much oh, let's see. Really use some fresh air. Yeah, you heard Hank. I mean, you got to stay here at the DEO. Yeah, you know, I'll bet if I were outside, it's I could not... fly like Kara. Hmm. Nice try, buddy. No, we gotta stay here. Them's the rules. Out a bit. I mean, I'm new here. I'm trying to make a good impression. I don't have money to afford oh. Nice to see Wynn having fun. <laughs> you lie to me. I know about the fights, Pagan. I never lied you to you. You never asked. Don't give me that. That's the well, reason she didn't why lie. you didn't want to take the bond. Because then I'd know how you were spending your nights. No, that's spend my not nights why. Is no one's business but my own. Who runs the fights? Why? So I can stop them. You don't know who you'd be going up against. Jai. She has. You want to still be there. You want to relive it over and over. I don't. I want to forget. I will never forget my wife and daughters. They're dead. She calls herself Roulette. Her yeah, real right. name is Veronica Sinclair. 
Don't come back here. I know my comic knowledge. And what about the ones you kidnap and force to fight? Some of them owe me money. Fighting's just a way of getting squared. And if they die in the ring? Plenty more where that came from. Oh, she's really good at like playing a bad guy. And like when she plays the bad guy, I actually just hate her. But I love her in Dollhouse because she's so sweet and adorable. But I hate her here. <laughs> and I hated her on um, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah, she's just, she's got one of the, she's just one of those um, people that are like really good at playing at one side or playing at the other, you know? Wynn took Monel on a jaunt through the city last night. By some miracle, nobody is dead, but we were lucky this time. You should have talked to him. Me? Hey, let him go. How let is that him go. Everything we do is under a microscope. All right, but. We work so hard to make humans trust him. us. All it takes is for one keep alien someone to keep someone cooped up. Hank told me I needed to stay here because it wasn't safe. But he didn't mean for me. He meant it wasn't safe for humans from me. After I first got to Earth, I went to my junior prom, and Scott Klein asked me to dance. I stepped on his foot, and I broke three of his toes. My dad was a scientist, and my mom fought for justice. They were proud, strong people. Good Kryptonians, and, and even better parents. And that's the way I want to remember them. Hey, I, uh, I heard you survived Draga. <laughs> I once saw him fight on Warworld when I was uh, guarding the royal family. Drago took a blade to the right leg. It hit a nerve cluster. His favorite has left ever since. Thank you. Huh. It is not my place to tell you how to live. That's true. But I won't abandon you either. I'm not worth your kindness, John Jones. Trust me. Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, this is my oh. fault. She's so fast. I just need to talk to you. Jess, will you make a note downstairs that Cara Danvers is to be shown in right away whenever possible? Yes, Miss Luther. Really? So, is this gonna Thank be you? like a Lex and Clark thing? Like, How can I help? I, my friends? I think. But do you know where she's holding the next fight? I wouldn't ask if I had any other option. Luther, of course, I'm invited to her little pop up. Not that I'm interested in her type of entertainment. <sighs> Thank you. Tonight, they fight to the death. Awkward. I don't fight to the death. Tonight, you do. I will not fight you. We don't have a choice. Our choices are all we have. <laughs> I was going to say, you always have a choice. I like the, the way that the Martians look now. They look very, uh, very CGI. You don't fight for money. You do it because you think you deserve it. For surviving. But you don't have to punish yourself anymore, Magan. You're forgiven. We both are. Aliens are not the enemy, she is. And the more we fight each other, the more we distract ourselves from the real problems. Cadmus, people like Roulette, they say we're dangerous. That's what they want everyone to believe. Don't let them be right about us. You're under arrest. For what? For operating without a liquor license, for starters. <coughs> Orders came down from on high. We have to let her go. Why? It's all about timing. Having the right friends at the right moments. Your day will come. Look, I know in crappy moments like this, I could use a drink. So, what do you say? First round's on me. Oh, can't. Hey, babe. Next time? Yes. 
It's the one with the official NCPD crime report, forensics from the ME's office, and an on-the-record first-person account. Really? Who's your source? Supergirl. Developing sources. Good. Your nut graph is too long. You have multiple run-on sentences. You're not using AP style right again. I asked the DEO to release you into my custody. Really? I was sent to protect my cousin. To teach him and keep him safe. Yeah. And now you kind of get a second chance at that. that purpose. So, not your cousin. in a weird way, helping you, it gives me another chance to do that. I'm sorry to be such a disappointment to you. Like you said, the past is overdone. What matters is what happens now. Uh, well, that was Supergirl Season 2, Episode 4, uh, titled Survivors. Um, so I knew that Megaron was a white Martian because I've seen Young Justice. Um, and that is such an interesting storyline um, in that show. Um, I kind I don't know. That's very early to, like, show that she was a white Martian. I don't know if I like that. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they'll do something really good with it, but I feel like maybe that was, I don't know. Because the idea is like, you like, you, you learn more about Megan and all that kind of stuff and you really sympathize with her as a character and then you find out that she's a white Martian. She's only been like, one and a half episodes now, so we don't really know her, we don't really sympathise with her, we don't really care that much about her, and then you've revealed that she's a white Martian, so like you've got even less reason to trust her. Yeah, so I don't know, it's a little early I think, but I guess we'll find out. I'm sure there's a good reason. Um, also, are they doing what I think that they're doing with Alex? <laughs> I thought, like, I... What happened to Maxwell Lord? I don't understand. I... Never really got the vibe that she was, um... That she swung that way. Um... To me, I thought that she was, like... I don't know. I thought that she was into Maxwell Lord. They had like they shared a moment in the finale, and I don't know. Maybe I'm maybe I'm reading into this. I don't know. Um, I like what they're doing with um, Kai Parker and Kara. It was good. Uh, it was good to see Win have some time. You know. To have some fun because win is great um and we saw Jai Ying this episode so that's cool um i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in the next one <laughs> uh which by the way i'm going to just let you guys know um next week there is two supergirl and then two flash episodes so i hope you guys are excited I'll see you then. Uh, uh, uh.